hi how are you doing in this video we will explain one of the photoshop um, designs or projects which is multiple me um, the final uh, result or the final outcome will be the same as we're having here uh, the main idea of the project is to uh, like take a photo of yourself in different poses and then add those um, photos to the same design here we're having uh, that girl uh, she took uh, different poses for herself okay they are here okay and then she added them into uh, one design as we're having here we're going to um, like um, implement the same project using um, a different idea feel free to take uh, different photos and different poses for yourself we're going to download from the internet um, photos for uh, the same character in different poses and we're gonna use them instead of like uh, taking different photos for yourself uh, I already downloaded mine uh, here in desktop and I'm gonna do the same sample we did in the zoom session uh, here we have the photos I downloaded for a dog okay uh, for the same dog in different poses I mixed the photos of uh, the dog uh, here in uh, that design which is like a garden uh, to create the same uh, design uh, I need to close this first then from file click open okay uh, I'm gonna select the first photo then uh, hold the control to be able to select the rest of the photos okay now i'm having all of my photos here um, i renamed it the background uh, or the background photo as a uh, background okay i already selected it yes it's here okay then i'm going to uh, drag and drop each photo or each dog photo to uh, the background here to have them here uh, as a layers plus the background one uh, I'm gonna start with this one okay from the select okay if you cannot drag him just double click the lock here okay and from the select drag and drop here to the background okay uh, the size of the photo is somehow big so from the handles here drag to minimize the photo of the dog so we're having a full view of the dog photo okay make sure to tick here to save uh, so i don't need the photo of that dog close no okay this one again drag and drop if you cannot drag and drop just click the lock here to unlock and then drag and drop to the background okay again i need this one is okay on we may minimize it a little bit and from here again minimize okay Okay, we can maximize it to be the same as the background and tick here for saving close no okay. drag this one again here okay we can maximize him this time and True. Okay, close. Again, we're gonna drag. Okay, we need to unlock. Okay. okay. Just to minimize a little bit. Okay. 
okay this is fine and check no okay again drag and drop here just this one is fine and finally close this one now in the background i'm having the background layer layer one two three four and five i'm gonna start from uh, layer five i need to like cut uh, the dog only and delete the surrounding background we're gonna do this using the polygon tool okay uh, this one and i'm going to like click and move okay and then move the trick here is just moving a small space to keep the curves of uh, the dog if you just move like um, a long space uh, the curves of the dog will not be correct so just click and move and click move and click and it will just take some time to make it perfectly okay Finally, we're going to uh, match the, the end of the line here to the starting of the line here. Just click, click, click and match them. Once they are um, matched or we joined um, the end and the start, we're going to have like the dashes. Okay, uh, click here in the square with the hole. Okay, this one. Okay, this one for adding a new uh, layer mask, okay, and here we can like minimize that dog, okay, click here or we may set that layer now to be invisible, okay, and then we're going to repeat the same action with dogs in layer 4, 3, 2 and 1, again click here and start cutting the outline of the dog step by step step by step and then match the starting with the end finally click the rectangle with the hole which is add new layer mask okay i'm just moving fast okay if by mistake you uh, attach it the the end of the line to uh, the beginning of the line you need to start from the beginning okay Now I'm done with uh, cutting the background from uh, layer uh, layer uh, 5, 4, 3 uh, and 2. Uh, I didn't do the dog in layer 1. I'm gonna keep it invisible. I'm going to make all of them 
visible by clicking the eye here now I'm having the four dogs I can select the first one and just move him or minimize or maximize his size we're going to place each one in a different place like here make sure to be like a suitable place for him to make um, the scene somehow this one is um, directing or looking to the right so I'm gonna place him here just click tech and move this one okay and try to minimize him a little bit okay and tech move this one as well and this one okay I'm going to place this one here okay and click true uh, and I'm going to place this one here and this one will be here and minimize its size and mm, place him here tick mm, this one will be I guess here with a little bit minimization okay tick we're done with placing our dogs in the suitable place now it's time to merge all the layers in one layer okay uh, to do that we're going to click the layers menu and select merge visible so all layers will be merged except for layer one the invisible one then we're going to click the layer again and click smart object and convert that layer to a smart object okay if we need to add some adjustment to our design for example we need to change um, the lightening of um, the, the, the photo uh, working more on the light and so on we're going to click adjustment and from curves here uh, you can change the light of uh, the image by moving the line here up and down up will increase the light down will change the light a little bit okay I'm done with that one which is okay if you want to work more on the colors of uh, your design click adjustment here and from uh, vibrance you can adjust the color or make them like black and white okay and from here you can work more on the degree and the transparency of the color okay I guess this one is fine uh, finally you can select that layer uh, which is the merged one and from filter you can select filter gallery you can work on the different filters texture styling and so on if you wish um, I'm gonna keep it as it is finally file save okay um, make sure to save it with the Photoshop format as a PSD file and click save I'm having already one with the same name so I'm gonna name it like background 2 and save okay uh, your assignment will be doing the same task definitely with any character you wish um, I used a dog uh, you may use um, another animal you can use any celebrity you can download different photos for him in different poses um, you may use um, a football player um, you may use like as we said in the zoom session you may use um, the members of 
BTS and add them uh, on a background, uh, a stage background and so on. Feel free to uh, do your own design using the same skills we learned today.